Water use efficiency is a big one. Uh, in terms of productivity, it's probably the biggest opportunity for growers. BMP actually does improve a lot of farms because they realise things that they didn't necessarily know before. With irrigation, you will use a lot of electricity if you're pumping so much water out and you don't actually know your soil water holding capacity. It teaches them a lot about that and how they can improve and even reduce costs on the farm. So that's a big bonus. To sit down and write down these management plans took a bit of thinking, but once, once you got your head around it, most of the things that, that I'd done on this farm and my father's done were just fitted in with the BMP perfectly. For my irrigation, I just put a notebook in each pump attached to a farm map. We have a program that ticks off the paddocks that are being irrigated, which pumps are actually irrigating that day, and it's only a tick and flick for me. And then my wife transfers that into a, a bigger spreadsheet on the computer. I use IrigWeb, the program for scheduling. It does take a bit of time to set up, but once it's set up, uh, it's, it's a great tool and I've found it really helpful. I've got a book in the ute and I basically write down a pan reading, date pan reading, um, and also the amount applied. The records I keep in one of my pumps, I write the date and the metre reading on the wall of the shed. And when I first said that, one of the facilitators from further north just said, garbage. So of course we had to go and have a look at it. But it's all there back to about 2014. We haven't got too many water meters here, so we, the only way we can uh, test is just a bucket and a stopwatch. Irrigation records, it really is a case of trying to record how much moisture is in your soil in the first place. So recording your rainfall, recording your irrigation and how much you are putting on, and then taking note of how much water is being used by your crop. And there are various ways that you can do that, from having moisture monitors in the field to using evapotranspiration data, which um, various industry staff can help people with. Trying to match your application amount to your soil water holding capacity isn't easy, but we're getting better and better. We've got soil moisture probes, we've got programs like IrigWeb. So if we can improve our, our water application amounts, it's a cost saving and it's also better for the environment.